Hello, my name is Gintare and today I'll show you how to change a domain name in WordPress. Before learning how to change your domain name in WordPress, let's start with what is a domain name, why you might want to change your current one, and what to expect if you decide to change it. First, a domain name is the unique address of a website. It consists of the website's name followed by a domain extension. For example, our website domain name is hostinger.com. You might need to change your current WordPress domain name for different reasons. For example, if you want to rebrand your business, changing your domain name is an important step in creating your new brand identity. Or maybe the domain name you initially chose wasn't memorable enough and you'd like to change it to something more simple. Whatever your reasoning is, it's important to know what to expect when changing a domain name. After changing your domain, it's normal to experience some drop in traffic and page rankings. That's because Google will need time to recrawl and re-index your content under the new domain name. But if you follow the proper steps, you can reduce the risks of damaging your SEO efforts. Before I go through the steps of changing a domain name in WordPress, I highly recommend fully backing up your website first. By having a backup, you will be able to roll back to the previous version of your website if something goes wrong. If you use Hostinger, the easiest way is to use the backups tool on HPanel. Open HPanel, Files, Backups. Then click Files Backups and select it. Choose the most recent date and download. Now that we have a site backup, I will walk you through the six steps to change your domain name in WordPress. Let's begin. Purchase a new domain name. Of course, before changing your domain name, you should own the domain name you want to switch to. You can purchase a new domain name from a domain registrar of your choice. For this tutorial, I will show you how to buy a domain name at Hostinger. Go to Hostinger's Domain Checker, enter your preferred domain, if available, add to cart, checkout. Select the domain registration period. Click Checkout now. Add a new domain name to your hosting account. Now that you own a new domain name, let's add it to your hosting account. Here's how to do it on each panel. Open each panel, domains, add website. Add a new domain name and set a password. Click add website. Keep in mind that it might take up to 24 hours for the domain to propagate. Once it's over, the new domain will be added to your hosting account. Copy all WordPress core files from your old domain. Now, we will be cloning all of the website content from the old domain to the new one. We will do this by copying the contents of your old domain folder to the new domain folder. Open HPanel, Files, File Manager. Check whether both domain folders are present. Open the old domain folder, Public HTML. Select all the files and click Copy. Change the destination to the new domain's public HTML folder. Click Copy. Change the WordPress site address. Now, let's update the WordPress address with the new domain name. The easiest way to do this is via WordPress Admin Dashboard. Open WordPress Dashboard, Settings, General. Replace the current WordPress address URL and site address URL with the new domain name. Save changes. Sometimes these fields might be grayed out due to set fixed values in the wconfig file. If this is the case, follow these steps to update your WordPress URL directly from the wp-config file. You can find and edit this file via the file manager. Open each panel, files, file manager. Open the new domain folder, public HTML. Locate wp-config page p, right click, edit. In the following code, replace old domain with a new site URL. Click save and close. Reset the URL structure. After changing your WordPress URL, it's important to update the URL structure of your posts and pages. If you keep the same structure, your visitors might get a 404 error. Follow these steps to reset your URL structure. Open WordPress Admin Dashboard, Settings, Permalinks. Select a different permalink structure, Save Changes. Revert to the original permalink structure and again Save Changes. 
redirect your old WordPress domain permanently. The final step is to create 301 redirects. Their purpose is to redirect all URLs associated with the old domain to the new domain. This will carry over page ranking values, helping to preserve your hard-earned SEO results. Now, we're also keeping your old domain active for a while for two main reasons. To help visitors who are not aware of the domain change reach your website and to help notify search engines about the redirection. Here's how to set up 301 redirects by editing your HT access file. Open each panel, files, file manager. Open the new domain folder public HTML. Find HT access, right click, edit. Replace the old domain with the new domain. Insert the following code. Then click save and close. That's it. You have learned how to change a domain name in WordPress in just a few easy steps. If this video has helped you, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more informative content. And feel free to leave a comment below if you have any questions or tips. See you in the next video.